Hello, welcome to Cat Chat. It's Emily from the Behavior Department here at Haws, and I have Pepito here. We are an adorable little adoptable kitten who, as you can see, is positive for FIV. So I'm going to talk to you a little bit about FIV. Um, FIV stands for Feline Immunodeficiency Virus. Hi. Um, and it essentially means that they have a lowered immune system. Many cats can live full, long, healthy, happy lives um, and live just as long as a cat without FIV, uh, but some cats do start to show some symptoms over time. Um, so you just want to make sure that anytime you do um, get or are considering getting an FIV positive cat that you are keeping an eye out for their immune system. Um, so making sure that they are staying healthy and happy, making sure you're cleaning those um, food and water dishes and just really staying on top of any time they're sneezing or things like that and getting that treated right away and not letting it uh, uh, risk sitting to chance. Um, but yes, really, compromised immune system, it absolutely cannot be transferred to people or to dogs or other pets. It is strictly to other cats. Um, and it is typically through a very deep bite. Hi. And it's very, very <laughs> common in outdoor cats. So it's very important to make sure that you're keeping your cats indoors to make sure that they're not catching it from outdoor cats um, and risking those deep bites as well. So don't let that FIV scare you. Um, oh, I should also mention that we have a very young cat kitten who is tested positive for FIV, but it can also be transferred through a mother. And once those maternal antibodies pass through their um, system around six months or so, they can actually be cleared of FIV. So it is always a good idea to retest your cat over time to see if those have passed. So remember to take a look at these FIV positive cats and have a great day. Good boy.